It means that everything is connected, the mountains to the ocean, and they're actually connected by salmon. All the new tunnel people have survived with that. Um, you don't see that anymore. The companies are Norwegian. They imported the eggs from the Atlantic Ocean from Europe, and those eggs brought with them Piscine Orpho virus, and the, the fish here had no defense against it. And I have been looking closely at hundreds of juvenile pink and chum salmon every single year. The juvenile salmon that come out of the river, by the time they made it to the open ocean, they passed four or five salmon farms and they were just dying, hundreds of thousands of them. Right now, the gray whales are having a catastrophic die-off, and in the spring, we're getting gray whales washing up on shore that are starving to death, and if they don't have their food because it's been poisoned by Cermak, then we won't have any whales throughout the summer months in this area. And this is gonna be devastating. Orcas have culture, and to maintain their culture, they need to gather. And for resident orca to gather, there have to be a lot of salmon. That's how they maintain not only their health, but their culture. In recent years, it's been really sad to see they come in, Sometimes they pace up and down, one little family, and then they leave. This past year, CERMAC designed a new experimental type of fish farm, and it's the semi-closed containment system, and we knew that no one would be up there monitoring it except for the company itself. And so we had to get up there and figure out, does it make any difference for wild salmon? What exactly is going on? I know how the ocean sounds like but I've never heard a vibration or a sound like this before. Our ancestors never needed huge corporations to feed our people because we lived off of salmon, deer, you name it, that's well. And as soon as we start taking over those territories and, and start regulating some of the industry here, um, we're going to see a little more balance restored. I truly believe that. We just want to be self-sufficient. We want to be able to put our young people to work. We want to be on our territory. We want to go home. We want to go to our lands.